Sunday. My house is a mess, so we're gonna do a Sunday reset video today. I've never showed my routine online, really. Um, we have like this whole routine we like to do on Sundays, and it was actually one of my goals for this year to like be better at doing it. I haven't accomplished it every week, but the weeks I do, I feel so much better and ready for the week ahead. So hopefully this gives you some motivation to have a Sunday reset routine yourself, but yes, my house is a mess. Everything's unorganized and I want to just like get my food prepped for the week, myself prepped for the week, like mentally planning and all of it. So I'll share the steps I kind of go through and let's get started. Really quick, I'm also drinking my yerba mate drink for some energy and then I'm just going to show you guys my outfit in case I get any outfit questions. My tank top is from Amazon. It's literally just a tank top cut very poorly at the bottom and then my Aritzia cargo pants. I have this clip in, I think it's from Free People, but you could probably find it on Amazon. And yeah, we're gonna start by just like tidying my house up. because he set them up and like put random products on there for me to like decide if they look good. I'm gonna switch all of the products to things I actually use every day so I'm gonna do that but I'll probably do that off camera and then show you guys after. Right now I'm just gonna like wipe down the bathroom. just finished organizing my skincare shelf I took forever but it's pretty much all skincare a little bit of hair care okay so I have drunk elephant in this corner then Sunday Riley I have like another L'Oreal vitamin C serum behind there and then all my sunscreens on top we have Caudalie and then Indie Lee Gizu that is like a lip oil and then a hair oil so it's not technically skincare and I just put my day hair oil up there because it's cute and then my favorite Osea face wash I'm kind of out of Osea right now so I need to restock like on all their other products at the top we have Primally Pure you guys know I love Primally Pure then we have used to the people next to it in Beauty. In Beauty is an amazing affordable brand at Sephora. They have such cute packaging too. And I have my Glow Recipe Serum next to it and then Colleen Rothschild. I have been absolutely loving this face oil. I hope it focuses. It's face oil number nine. It is so good guys. But I'm super happy with how it turned out. I think it looks so cute and I think it'll help me just like branch out with my skincare a little bit more. Sometimes I use like the same products every single day for months which is fine but I want to like try more and just experiment a little bit more. Okay now that I've kind of cleaned and tidied most of my house I still have like some laundry to fold and I'm gonna do the floors like later after I'm done with meal prepping and dinner. I'm gonna start planning my week. I like to plan my content and then my meals and things we're doing. So this is what I use to plan my content. I have like a content calendar and I actually haven't written on it yet this month, but this is where I like to write down all of the videos I'm gonna be making throughout the week, like when I'm filming, any deadlines I have. So I'm gonna go through my emails, kind of see like what I need to put on there. Now that I've kind of planned out my content for the week, I'm going to 
make my grocery list. I'm not gonna buy everything that I need for all of my recipes right now, but I want to meal prep tonight as well. So I'm gonna need some ingredients for that. Also, because I'm gonna be like cooking dinners all week, I'm kind of more gonna prep like ingredients. Like I'm gonna do rice, I think some boiled eggs because we have a bunch of eggs in our fridge. Probably a healthy treat for the week. I wanted to do some ginger lemon shots and maybe something else. I kind of need to figure out what I'm doing. So to plan my meal prep, I kind of just wrote a list of the things I wanna make. So I said boiled eggs, rice, date bites, overnight oats, and chia seed pudding, cold brew, roasted potatoes, ginger shots, and berries. Then for our grocery list, I just have berries, ginger, and lemon because we have everything else. Last thing I kind of like to plan on Sundays is basically just mine and Chris's activities. So if we have any dates, kind of what we're up to that day. So if I have like a full work day, I'll write that down. If I have a free day, I'll write that down. Now that I'm done kind of planning my week, I have like my meal prep list, my weekly plans, and then my content calendar all filled up. We are going to go to the grocery store. I'm gonna get my groceries and then we're gonna come back and meal prep everything. Then after all of that, we'll do all of the self care, shave my legs, wash my hair, and we're just gonna have a great reset self care night. Okay, going to the grocery store now. Quick little grocery haul before I start meal prepping. So I ended up getting a lot more stuff than I expected. To start off, I got this Greek yogurt for my overnight oats, and then I also got some strawberries. I wanted to do like a strawberries and cream overnight oats. Got some sparkling waters because we love our sparkling waters. Bought this bag of produce, which is amazing because it's only sold for $3.94, and we love freezing a bunch of bananas that are overripe for smoothies. These blue corn tortilla chips for like chips and guac. All my stuff for ginger shots, and then I got some stuff for dinner tonight. Then these coconut waters, I've talked about these on here before. If you ever come to Hawaii and have the chance to try one of these, they have them at 7-Elevens in Tamara's, you should definitely get this. Best coconut water you'll ever have in the world. I feel so passionately about this. Even people who don't like coconut water will literally fall in love with this. I'm gonna fold some laundry and then we're gonna start meal prepping. laundry is all folded now i'm gonna start meal prepping like crazy again we're doing overnight oats freezing the bananas boiled eggs roasted potatoes i'm also gonna be making dinner in between all of this so let's do it and i'm gonna be blasting music i will be blasting lana del rey if you're wondering <laughs> That was a lot of work and it took a couple hours, but it's so worth it. I'm so excited to eat this all week. We have my date bites. I'm going to transfer these to a different container. Ginger lemon shots, hard boiled eggs, roasted sweet potatoes, or sorry, roasted potatoes. And then we have my cold brew, rice, and then strawberries and cream overnight oats. I'm going to clean out and organize the fridge and then I'll show you guys what it kind of looks like after. All right, we organized and cleaned out our fridge a bit. So up here we have our overnight oats and then some like random jarred stuff behind it. Limes tub because we use a lot of limes, like dairy, our AG1, and like supplements. This is our like produce, fruit area, potatoes, boiled eggs, and rice. And then we just have some like random veggies and some chickpeas back there. This is like our bread and nuts bin, I don't really know. Set up our drinks and then we have like just our regular eggs in a little tub, applesauce and hummus, and then we have our sparkling waters and ginger shots. So happy this is all set up. 
Now we're just gonna clean up, finally eat dinner, and then I'm gonna do my self-care reset routine. Really quick, this is what we're eating tonight. I made cilantro lime bowls, and I did chickpeas instead of black beans tonight, because that's what we had in the fridge. Then I just made some guac on the side, and we're just gonna add it to our bowls and eat it with chips. Okay, best part of the whole day, we're gonna be doing a bunch of self-care for my Sunday reset. Okay, I'm gonna take off my makeup with the Primally Pure Cleansing Oil. It is great for taking off any face makeup. You put it on dry skin and you just rub it around really good. And then I really prefer using a makeup wipe for like my eye makeup just because I feel like it's more gentle on my eyelashes. Rub my eye until all my mascara comes off. Okay, now that I use the oil cleanser, I'm just going to go in with my Drunk Elephant Jelly Cleanser to kind of clean up any of the excess makeup. Now that my makeup is off, I'm just going to dry brush my legs with this Osea dry brush and then I'm gonna hop in the shower and like wash my hair wash my body so I'm gonna show you the shampoo and conditioner that I like to use I'll switch off a little bit but the main one I use is the Bonaboo thickening therapy shampoo and conditioner it has been so amazing for my hair and I would really recommend this then I'll use like the salt and stone body wash and then I'll use like the uh, I think it's Brio Geo hair mask sometimes they're hydrating hair mask and it's really good i'll probably do that tonight okay i just got out of the shower and i lathered my body with the osio body butter and body oil if you don't have this you should really get it i have a discount code for this actually so i'll leave it in the description but this stuff is amazing together i like literally rebuy it every time then we're gonna throw a couple things in my hair so first bondi boost thickening therapy spray i love this i feel like i see so much hair growth when i use it Literally just spray it into my roots and like massage it into my hair. Then the Living Proof Triple Bond Complex. I love this as well. I'll just do like two pumps and run it through. And last thing, I've recently been using the Hair Proud Hair Revival Leave-In Scalp and Hair Moisturizer and it is amazing. It literally makes your hair so shiny and it just brushes out so easily. I just do a bunch of sprays of this all over my hair. And I'll grab my wet brush and just brush through my hair really well, starting at the bottom, and then I'll work my way to the top. I'm actually going to throw on this headband because I forgot I wanted to dermaplane my face tonight. If you've never dermaplaned before, I would really recommend it. It's great for, like, exfoliation and... It makes your makeup look way smoother because you don't have like a bunch of baby hairs. I just bought these off Amazon and they work really well. All I do is throw some oil on my face. I'm using the Drunk Elephant Marula Oil. And then I'll just start shaving down like that. My face is dermaplaned. I wanted to do a face mask tonight. I bought this like four pack of face masks from Amazon. They're all Dr. Jart. But I just don't think I'm going to. I kind of just want to like relax and watch a show with Chris. So I think I'm just going to do my skincare. I have to decide what I want to use. I'm going to start with the Soothing Serum by Primally Pure. This stuff is so good if you feel like your skin is a little bit irritated which I kind of do after I dermaplane. Then I think I'm gonna follow up with the Indie Lee Squalene Facial Oil. This is great for hydrating your skin as well. And I'm gonna go in with the Soothing Cream by Primally Pure. I'm really into just like hydrating and soothing my skin all the time. I'm not really big on exfoliation because my skin is very sensitive, but every once in a while I'll do something and I put on vitamin C in the mornings. And then I'm gonna finish up with this Colleen Rothschild face oil number nine. Seriously, my favorite product right now. Face oil is always my favorite product. All right, done doing my skincare. My face feels very glowy, dewy. I'm gonna go grab my pajamas, put them on, and then I'm gonna go watch a show. Okay, I have my pajamas on. These are the most comfy, silky pajamas in the world. They're from Lunia, and I seriously love them. I'm also wearing these Ugg slippers I love. I have these linked to my Amazon storefront if you want to get them. I actually forgot I need to finish making my bed really quick, so I'm gonna do that. officially done with my Sunday reset. I just feel so ready and excited for the week now that I feel like everything is in place. Let me know if you guys like this video. If you liked it, don't forget to like it and leave a comment and tell me what you liked. I'm happy to make more of these videos, but just let me know your feedback. If you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe and thank you so much for being here. You guys are the best. I'll try to be a bit more consistent with Sundays, but thank you so much again. I love you guys and I will